Hey guys, KRX50 here with another review. This time I'll be reviewing the Deluxe Shift Fruits and Drive Lux Seed set from Conrad Drive. This is a special set released tied with the movie Conrad, Conrad, Drive and Gaim, Movie War Full Throttle. So, as indicated by the name of the set, this includes two things one shift car and one lock seed. So, we'll take a look at each of these individually and then with their respective belts. So, we'll start off with Shift Fruits. As the theme of this set is the riders swapping powers with each other, Drive gets a shift card based on Gaim's orange arms. So to start, this is cast in a nice metallic orange plastic, similar to the arms change version of the orange arms. As you'll see it's got various bumps on it like orange arms has. You'll also see some painted white orange slice designs, similar to the Dai Dai Maru covering both the wheels and on the spoiler. And then on the hood, it's got a gold painted orange design similar to the inside of the orange lock seed. It's got a nice blue trim along the bottom to represent Gaim's undersuit. And you have some small silver wheels that are actually covered by the orange slice parts. Flipping around, we of course get the standard thing for a type changing shift car which is a metallic sticker of Drive Symbol. And with, Gaim, with Drive giving Gaim his powers, he gets a lock seed based on Drive's type speed. So this is stylized similar to most of the Legend Runner lock seeds with a little bit of difference to it. So start, this has a metallic paint front and silver back, like with regular Legend Rider lock seeds. And the front color is a metallic red paint, though it's a little bit deeper than the one used for the Wizard lock seed. Then you have the front cover, which is where things change up. While it is similar to other Legend Rider lock seeds, where it has the uh, rider's face on the front tilted to an angle, and then the words ran around in a ring. Notice that the ring is actually based on the type speed tire. So it actually has type speed ran on instead of counting a drive. You can see a little bit of the inner tire in here painted silver. You also notice that besides, of course, the paint, the various paint details for uh, drive type speed's helmet, I actually got some clear plastic for the eyes, but still has that pattern on the inside of the headlights that Drive's forms have. And like the others, it does have the little spring part on pants so you can see the mechanism in there. So straightening on, you'll see why it has these clear parts. So along with the startup sound, we can see that it has a white light that actually shines through the eyes. This is not the first time that this happened with the lock seed. However, the first time was with a set I have not reviewed, which was the Conrad Tyson set for the Heisei 15 Rider Lockseed and the Showa 15 Rider Lockseed, which I may or may not get in the future. So to start, we have the back button sounds. Now these are unique to this Lockseed, and they're not the Legend Rider Battle Start kind of sounds that the other four had. So starting with the first sound, it's a crack opening sound, then we get four sounds that are stylized versions of basic things for Conrad Drive. Max Flare, Funky Spike, Midnight Shadow, and Tridoron. Then after that, pressing again, you get a crack closing noise. And then you have the unlocking sound. I'll do that again. Then we'll set this aside. As now we'll use shift fruits with the drive driver and shift brace.
So there we have the transformation into drive type fruits. And what you'll notice is that it doesn't have an F for fruits because this is a special type. Instead, the image that is on screen is a picture of an orange. And the standby sound is a stylized version of the uh, Japanese style standby music for the Sengoku driver. Then we'll do shift up. You'll also notice a couple of uh, phrases from the Sengoku driver in, like on stage for the transformation, and soya for the shift up. Then she sats. set this aside and bring in the Sengoku driver along with the drive lock seed. So opening this up, set into place and lock on. So for that, you got a kind of Japanese-style version of drive type speed transformation sound, and a little play on his catchphrase, which is Hitopashiritsukiyo, or I'll take you along for the ride. In this case, it's Hitopashiritsukiyo together, or let's take a ride together. So then we have the three special attacks, right, which, of course, being a Legend Rider Lock Seed, aren't well, they aren't squash only sparking, but, you know, stuff taken somewhat from the original belt. In this case, with a Japanese-style twist. So this one was Hisats Full Throttle. Satan was a try run attack sound. And third was Tire Kokan. And of course, it's also compatible with the Loxied weapons. So, going back to the default, and the simplest one to display it with. We'll use the Muso Saber. You have drive, drive charge, and of course, drive power. And of course, we can also do the transformation cancel properly, like so. So overall, this is a great set. I really do like the concept of the riders kind of swapping powers with each other. 
uh, kind of swapping powers with each other. It's really quite a neat idea. Especially with how it's one that works, because for Drive, the way that works is obviously to have that sound programmed into the belt. And with Gaim, because it works off lock seeds, which are separate items that can contain their own sounds, it was easy to make one, a Drive lock seed. And this is one of the really the only cases where that could work. And both of them do work, as they do represent the writer's base forms quite well, and you can really tell by the details put into them. It's also cool how the sounds you get are, you know, not directly ripped from the opposite belt, but rather kind of a mix of the two belt styles of sounds. Where, with the drive driver and type fruits, you've got kind of a car mixed with Sengoku driver sounds. And for the drive lock seeds, it's kind of Sengoku Japanese style drive sounds. So that really does make this, you know, a pretty cool set if you're a fan of either Gaim, Drive, or both. Honestly, if you have either of these belts, this is definitely a set I recommend picking up. As far as I can tell, this is probably going to be the only way to get either of these two items. So you have one of the two items, or one of the two belts, or both, then I definitely say to pick this up if you're interested in these items. So, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and share my channel for more videos, as well as my Facebook page. And for now, this is KRX50, writing off.